hit open and boom shakalaka. Hi guys, today we're going to learn how to root a Show Me device, any Show Me device. I've got the Show Me Mi 8 here. It should also work on the Poco phone. And before I begin, um, you have to unlock the bootloader, all right, which I just did using uh, my UI uh, unlock tool. I do have a full tutorial guide on that. After that, the steps for rooting should be very simple. It is identical to standard Android root method. Uh, first thing you will need to do is put it into fast boot mode, all right, power off. Off. And we're going to put it into fast boot mode by holding down volume down and the power. All right, once powered off, hit the volume down and the power. All right, you should see fast boot just like that. Um, go ahead and connect it to a USB Type C cable to your computer. And let's go to our computer. All right, guys, before going further, you need to have drivers installed. Um, go to Hardware and Sound, go to Device Manager. All right, guys, if you don't see Android ADB interface, um, go ahead and download the USB underscore driver dot zip. I'll have link to this URL. Go ahead and go all the way to the bottom where it says click here to download. Don't click on these ads. And once downloaded, go ahead and unzip it. All right. Uh, next, you're going to go and go into your device manager. Double click on the Android with exclamation mark. Hit update driver, go to browse my computer for software, go to let me pick from a list of device drivers, go to show all devices, have disk, and go ahead and browse to the download folder and to the USB driver folder where you just unzip the USB drivers. So this is just standard USB drivers. I'm hit OK. And click next. And that should install the drivers. All right, once installed correctly, you should see Android ADB interface at the bottom here. All right. All right, also you'll need a fastboot.zip. Go ahead and download this. Um, click here to download down here. I'll have all the links where you gotta download all this stuff. All right, also go ahead and download Magisk um, v17.2, which is I'm using. Now, if you're watching this in the future, there may be new versions of Magisk you may be able to use. So check my tutorial. It will have all the updated links. All right, so go ahead and download that. All right, once you have downloaded fastboot.zip, double click it, extract all files. I already did, and um, you'll get a folder called fastboot. All right, you'll have all the files you need for Windows, Mac, and Linux. Um, next, you're gonna go ahead and um, download um, twerp recovery for your Xiaomi device. So I'm gonna go Xiaomi Mi 8. Ooh. Um, if you can't find it here, go to Mi 8 Twerp on Google and they should be working one. So right now there's no official versions, but you can go ahead and use from one from XDA. So let me grab this latest version here. All right, guys, once downloaded, um, usually official versions begin with twerp blah blah dot IMG, but this one just, it does, the, the name doesn't really matter, but go ahead and copy that image file and copy it into your fast boot folder, just like that and you're gonna go ahead and paste. All right, and we'll go ahead and leave this on the side here. You can go ahead and open up a command prompt, go ahead and type CMD in search or however you wanna do it. I'm also for Mac or Linux, go ahead and open a terminal. If you don't know how, go Google it. Now here is where you're gonna type these different commands for Mac or Linux, but if you have Windows, go ahead and type CD downloads, enter, CD fastboot, enter. And you're gonna go ahead and type fastboot space flash space recovery space and then you're gonna go ahead and type in this uh, file name here whatever it is um, but an easy way to do it just go ahead and type the first four letters for the example C R E C O V R E C O V and then hit the tab key on your keyboard and it will fill it out for you and let's see if this works this should work and flash tour recovery and hit enter and you can see, okay, okay, so it flashes fine. All right, next you're gonna type uh, fastboot reboot. And as soon as it reboots, you're gonna hold down volume down, a volume up and the power, which will enter you into recovery. All right, ready? So hit enter, volume up and power. And hold it. And, okay, one more second. And let go. And boom shakalaka. You should now be in torp recovery. All right, guys, once in Torp Recovery, uh, a lot of the show me might be in Chinese by default. Don't worry about it. Go ahead and hit the language here. Change back to English. And if you set a passcode, you may have to um, 
enter the pattern here to decrypt it. And you can see data successfully decrypt it. And you can just keep it uh, read only. All right. Next, go back to the downloads folder and copy the Majisk v17.2.zip. .zip. Copy. And you should be able to actually copy it um, into the internal storage. It, it should it should mount automatically as a disk drive. Now, if for some reason you can't do this, just simply reboot your phone and copy it over when your phone is booted. Now, another note, once you install Torp Recovery and you don't enter Torp Recovery, it might overwrite it. So make sure you flash Torp and boot into Torp right away because I actually lost Torp and I had to reflash it while making this video. But go ahead and go to install now and go ahead and find the Magist v17.2, confirm to flash and you don't need this cable anymore. And you should have a fully rooted uh, Xiaomi phone. All right, this will work on any Xiaomi devices. All right, go to home reboot system. And if it asks you to install um, Torf Recovery, just say no. All right, that should be pretty much it. Very easy to root Xiaomi devices, Xiaomi devices. Pretty much identical to the universal method, but the buttons are a little bit different. Volume up and power to get into the recovery, right? where usually most Androids are volume down and power. Now you should see Majisk Manager, all right? And if you see latest installed, installed version, you're good to go, you're fully rooted, congratulations. All right, to verify you have full root, download the free Titanium Backup app on the Play Store, hit open, and boom shakalaka. You should see a super user request window, make sure you grant, uh, and you should be good to go here. Now, when you're installing a custom ROM, there may be a chance you might lose Torp Recovery. This just happens on stock firmware because they tend to overwrite Torp Recovery. Just repeat the steps in this tutorial to flash Torp Recovery and you should be able to access Torp again. But that's why I prefer custom ROMs because once you install Torp Recovery, it installs permanently and you don't have to worry about it. And if your safety net check passes, now you can also hide root. Um, so you can go to Magisk Hide and hide root from stuff like Pokemon Go, Fortnite, blah, blah, blah. I do also have a full tutorial guide on that. Uh, but have a great day. That was how to root uh, any Xiaomi device. Xiaomi device, whatever you want to call it. It should work on all of the um, Xiaomi devices. Have a great day. Hit the thumbs up and as always, stay on Android. Click here to subscribe.